Speeding and distracted driving continue to be major issues for motorists across the Commonwealth. Chelsea Swift joins us now in the studio after speaking with state police about an initiative to address the problem. Chelsea. Jill, that's right. State police and PennDOT representatives are educating motorists about the dangers of speeding and aggressive driving. It's Highway Safety Law Awareness Week, and Pennsylvania State Police are shedding light on the dangers of speeding and other traffic violations. According to preliminary data from 2021, speeding continues to be an issue in northwestern Pennsylvania. That can include speeding. It also can include, you know, changing um, lanes very quickly, um, you know, riding behind somebody very closely. All of those are unsafe driving behaviors, and we just want to remind people not to do any of those, and there's never a situation where any of those should be warranted. Daugherty says there was a 10% increase in road Roadway fatalities in 2021. He says many of those accidents were the result of speeding violations. So whether you run into some snowfall, heavy rain, uh, maybe driving at night or in foggy conditions, if you are need to drive slow enough to, to meet those conditions. So even if you're driving the speed limit, you can still be cited if you're going too fast for any inclement conditions. One state trooper says speeding isn't the only concern. Distracted driving is also a common dangerous offense. We have all those new devices and these new cars coming out. Everyone has some type of cell phone in their vehicle, whether they're obeying the law by not using it or maybe they're being safe and they're pulling over, but that, that device is still in the car. So those are distractions. Trooper Schick says state police want drivers to focus on the road and what they're doing behind the wheel. She says this makes it safer for police to slow down drivers if they are speeding and decreases the number of accidents. If you're stopped or pulled over for speeding or any other traffic violation, um, we ask you to stay in the vehicle for safety reasons. Um, that's safety for the driver and the other occupants in the vehicle and safety for the officer making the traffic stop. Trooper Schick says state police want to remind motorists to move over a lane when they see a traffic stop ahead. And if there isn't room to move over, drivers must reduce their speed. Jill. Thank you, Chelsea.